Oh, it's you. You are YouTube viewers. Yes. You're viewing another Wii U webcam because I'm Mandu. I'm Devin, artist at Soul Gear 7, coming back to you guys again. And it's about time for another Wii U webcam. <coughs> Want to start over? Would you like a cough drop? Yes. A hard candy? What about a horn hound? Yes. Horn. I do like those. those first, yeah, this is something we bought. Horn hound. We went to Farm and Home Supply and busted some shit. <laughs> I didn't get kicked out. Yeah, that, that sucked. That that <laughs> oh no, I I just I might as well have just thrown it on the floor because I was completely ignorant. I I broke a bottle of soda and it went all over my pants and my shoes and the floor. But I'm okay. We're all okay. Tell me how you broke it. I just I put it into the cart into the part where you would normally sit a child. And it slid out where the child hole, leg hole is. It just went shoop, right out the hole. <sighs> but anyway, we got some very good sodas from there. They have some nice locally brewed sodas. Some really good ones. And really? we, I think we drank them all. Oh, there's really one like Try that no? citrus one sometime. Since. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, we bought we left the bottle in the freezer. Well. But anyway, we have some like other glass drinks. Does when you freeze it. But yeah, this isn't glass. What's this yeah. you got there? Chi Chi's orange cream made with vodka. Yeah. Mm. I somehow doubt this is a natural color of this. Or natural flavor. Gosh, you can you can do orange so good because orange is just a naturally juicy fruit. But this is artificially flavored. I bet the vodka's not artificial. Let's let's have is that a what try. You wanna have? Yeah, let's have a try. Alright. I think this will be best over ice. I mean I think you're supposed to smoothie it up with like ice cream. And that'd uh, be good. ice that'd be, that'd be pretty good. I don't think we got any ice cream that would go with this in particular. We had, but then we yeah, we ate it all before. We tend to eat ice cream, you know, in the summertime when it's hot. I didn't put too much in here. Ooh, this smells strong. Like it's got alcohol in it or something. Yeah, that's been one of the. That's pretty good. I don't know. It, it, it's been. It tastes, summer. it tastes like it has actual orange in it. Well, that's good. It's been summer temperatures. I mean, it hasn't been super hot, but it's been. 80s, and then we had that heat wave, and it was 90s. So it's not a hundred, yeah, which is not nice, here in Illinois but it's yet. all too hot. Still, we also got this. You know what? I might slip a little bit in there. It's, we went all out. Got I have a chocolate liqueur, a white chocolate together? liqueur. I'll put a little bit in there for you. No problem. Okay. <sighs> Oh, this is nice. Saw it here first, folks. This is probably like the first time people have done this, or maybe <laughs> not. We don't drink oh, that much. Not, and this isn't even much anyway. Sheesh. I don't know what you will add in there, too. What flavor was that? White chocolate. Pretty good. We also got some sweet tea flavored vodka. You want to put that in there? No, in God, there? no, no. Okay. That's okay. And Devin had to choose this. That you can see. It has a sculpt sculpted into the glass. It is called Pirate's, Pirate's Blood. Blood. And if you can see, it has little chili peppers flipping around in there. 
Baltimore. It's made in Chicago, so it is kind of local. Honey wine with chili peppers. Honey wine. Now, we did recently go to the Wildlife Prairie State Park. Up near Havana. Havana City? Or Havana? One of those, Peoria? Yeah. All those places. It's near Peoria. It's yeah. Um, in a city. But yeah, we went to the uh, Ye Old English Fair. Mm -hmm. And that's where I got my little circlet here. It was very nice. It helped keep the sweat out of my eyes. It was a hot day. I also got this nice fan. This handmade fan. Okay, that's cool. Um, you can't see, you just you can't see anymore. I had a Hannah tattoo on my hand. If you're on my Facebook, then you will have seen pictures of that. Or a picture at least. We also purchased a few CDs by one of the performers there. Rascal Robert. He's got some music, some fair music, and some Christmas. All that he's he uses like a bunch of different cool instruments. He all plays he plays well. He's one man band. He's awesome sauce. And I think also in this bag we got honey sticks. Oh, four honey sticks. Also got a couple more of the uh, stone dice. One of which has fallen yeah. on the floor. It has. So, yeah. Yeah, like this. Where it is right now, but <laughs> I'm glad we got here. some more because I was like, you know what? That's what I said too. I was like, go ahead and get two because we're gonna lose one. I said it'll be like, okay, well now I have five. Here's another bag of stuff from the fair. I think this was our like ba last bag of fair stuff. Uh, it is a stone serpent hand carved. Another one of my uh, figurines of wondrous power. Yeah. So skull bead. There, there was another thing from the fair. I don't think we got them all out of the book bag. There. We'll have to There's get them just a moment here. That I got. Oh, the uncracked geode. That was an actual geode. He's got a few. Got this from my dad. Oh, the geode. Day, like Father's Day. Oh, okay. Yeah. There's a few coins. Yeah. I don't know so if you can tell me coins. what they are. Uh, one is a brothel house token. Yes. And the other <laughs> one is That's funny. some sort of Chinese for all one. Night. That's funny. Yeah, this is a Chinese one. It has a very nice looking it's dragon on it. For all night. <laughs> I guess that's all we have to show from the fair because I can't find my other last few little things. So maybe in a future thing you will show them. But anyway. Yeah, we'll try to find the additional stuff that we forgot or just didn't have ready to show and do, do another video showing those things. Yep. But yeah, here's a few toothless things I got from the Walmart. Because we love dragons. This is, what do they call this? A racing dragon? It's like something exclusive to Walmart. Yeah. As you see, it has a little handle that you squeeze and he flips his wings. I think it may just be the colors. And they have, he, he's all painted, I guess. We yeah, haven't seen the movie yet. Racing. As I say, I think they do racing. But um, his legs went forward and back. The front ones do anyway. So, but anyway, if you all didn't know, if you squeeze your hand like this for 12 minutes a day, it helps to reduce your blood pressure. It also helps improve your grip. And since I have toothless so much, and because this was pretty cheap. I got this little bank. It's a baby night fury. 
It don't look, I mean, it's toothless maybe, but it's, it doesn't have the tail damage like toothless does. Maybe it is like toothless when he's a baby or whatever, you know. But I thought it was extremely cute. That's very nice style bank. Let's see, um, oh, I got it in the mail. I got it in the mail. I got it in the mail. Uh, hair high. If you're familiar with Bill Clinton, he's a great animator. I've liked him for probably all my life. If you remember the Tracy Ullman show, I think he's a cartoon to be with the guys that were doing stuff to each other. So it's like, you know, really beating crap out of each other. I was kind of a water purifier. I'm not going to show you that, but. So now we don't have to lug jugs to the store anymore. <laughs> if it works. Yeah. <laughs> we did um, get one that malfunctioned after a few brews. Uh, but they, they sent us a brand new one right away. And they sent it to me for free. And I just sent them the malfunctioning one back. Um, they had a prepaid label. It was all pretty nice. Uh, I also got this little thing. It's cute. It's, it's very nice. I got to delete stuff. It's It's LCD screen. You ride on it. And then it disappears. It's a little scratched up, but I got it like 75% off, so that yeah. was great. Um, we also went to Free RPG Day at the Hidden Lair in Mount, Mount Zion. Zion, which is just south of Decatur. Uh, Devin got. Oh, that's what all those magazines were in my backpack. We got a bunch of, uh, what are those? What are those called? Modules. Modules. Adventure modules. Adventure modules. Um, <laughs> I don't know why I was looking, but I got another special thing from there that's on order. I'll talk about that. I I'll definitely make a special video when I receive this thing, so stay tuned. I got some dice, but Devin also got some dice. If you watch my videos regularly, mine anyway, you will see that I do scary story cubes. And I got my last set of story cubes there. Um, this is Voyages. And I did a recent story with them. Scary story with Devon dice. I got some pretty blue crystal dice. I like crystal dice. I have is that a, D a lot of them. I've Collected is there a D3 in here? Quite a few. Um, and I like the off number dice. I get them when I can. Is there a D5? Huh? There is a D5. Oh, nice. There and a D3. And a D3. I already have a D3, but having the other one is nice. Oh, there is a D4. I don't yep, there's know a D4. If there's a D2, though. No, there's no D2. That's a coin. Flip a coin. Yes. <laughs> oh, so God. I got a buttload of magic cards, too. And got some uh, miniatures. I was a little disappointed. Oh, yeah. We, we bought two packs. I opened one. He opened one. It was all white. All white. White, 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 white. But then he went and looked through some of the minis that were opened. They're twins. Like, hey, hey. Where we uh, And I got. What's this? What's his name? Whalebone Pilk. He has the ocean. And also I got her. She is Lady Ghoul. Better watch out, brothers. She might have 
uh, lethal STD. It's called zombie. What do you call zombie? Is it is it a disease? It can be. I know that one of the zombie games, that's one of the means of becoming a zombie. <laughs> is it a disease? Yeah. Don't have sex with the infected. It's basically you know, the moral of that story. I'll tell you something. Back in the day, there was this website called HockeyZombie.com. And that's how he turned into like a, an intelligent zombie. He had sex with a zombie. Um, I miss Hockey Zombie. If you know Hockey Zombie is around somewhere still, let me know because I miss Hockey Zombie. We have a few more things to show. Oh my. We have a whole bag of stuff. So, okay, I'll hold bag, you produce stuff and introduce stuff. It's this thing of fridge magnets that you got. Oh yeah, that, um, I guess that's supposed to go with the little leapfrog thing. Yes. Um, and it was but, yeah, it was only dollar. What was it originally? Like thirteen ninety cents. Yeah, about fourteen bucks. Um, I don't have the little leapfrog thing, I don't really care about it. But I I am known for my fridge magnet words. When friends come over they're like, Oh my gosh, your fridge is covered with magnet words. And now I need some more. So I got some more. Next item. Oh, this was the thingy for the the toothless race and drag. It just was exclusively at Walmart. So if you want one of your own, get it at Walmart. Oh, Mad Libs. Love Mad Libs. This is the original number one Mad Libs. It was a great way to help, you know, learn your grammar, nouns, pronouns, and all that stuff. Oh, but Devin wants your attention with his Skylanders toy. Yeah, I mean, action I figure or... Game figure? Yeah, whatever. I I have a few. I think they look kind of neat. I think they make for neat little interesting figures um, of the ones that were available and on sale for the cheap. This was the one that they had that I actually liked because I'd never seen it before. What's his name? This is Dino Ray. Dino Ray. Oh, he's got like Boomerang, he's got a boomerang. And he's a dinosaur. How and he's clever. like a dino and he's like a dino lizard man, dude. <laughs> so yeah, I, well, here's I thought another it was kind of neat. Exclusively I like for Walmart lizard, thing. Lizard folk, so yeah. I know. And um, I, I'm not a big fan of uh, <laughs> spiders myself personally, but I am a big fan of venom. So that is why I picked that up for the Venom one. As you can see, I had not he noticed he had a tongue. Yeah, mm. That's cool. That's that's one of the defining things of Venom throughout that's the many action cool. figures. Oh yeah, there's that one. I got myself a new giant crystal 20 sided knife counter. This isn't the kind of 20 sided you really want to roll, unless you want to annoy your fellow game players. Yeah, no. <laughs> it's great for chucking at people's heads, though, when they're not paying attention. Not really. Boss Monster! We finally got it. We want to show it off. Maybe we'll play it sometime. I'd like he says it's a card game. I don't know what you do really. It looks like a video game. But I guess you're supposed to like build stuff. When that we finally hit me. I didn't mean to hit you. When we <laughs> finally get around to playing, I will re make sure we record a video of us playing. So that we can put it out. What else you got? Yo! Oh boy. Yeah, I'm uh, considering getting back into Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, 
got this from Yeti. That's where we also got picked up boss monster okay. from. Fifteen bucks, which is pretty good because I think normally this is like at least eighteen or twenty. So, and then another Yu-Gi-Oh thingy because, as as I said, I'm interested in getting back into Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, and yeah, these were fair. We're on the cheap. I think we even got a, even got a discount of them, for, like both of them. Yeah, I think we got them together. Yeah, I think. Uh, I don't know. This game it says it's just ages six and up. I feel sorry for the six year olds that play this game because there's men, and when I say men, I do mean men that play this game competitively. Yeah. I mean, I don't even like to play Magic the Gathering competitively, and that's a very competitive game. I like to play it for fun, and I usually don't play any tournaments or anything anymore, just because I don't enjoy it. Oh, well. Well, show off your shirt. Oh, yeah, you, you have some this. additional <laughs> sleeves. Sandy Wolf. So, so, yeah, so you have enough sleeves for your magic deck if you want to complete that deck. You want to show off the shirts that we got? Well, Devin got, oh, I got these shirts for Devin. It's got a bunch of, like, key words on there. And it's in the shape of a 20 cider? Yes. I think that's pretty cool. Then, um,. <laughs> we, if I'm you're a, a Venom fan, fan yeah, you've Venom. seen this artwork before. Yes. They decided to put it on a t-shirt. It's on sale at a Walmart. Yeah, for like nine bucks. It's a really good deal. So if you nice, like Venom. Nice, nice shirt. Oh, very, Unfortunately, very slick. Just the, the material that it's made out of is kind of binding. Yeah. And as such... The king. Yeah, I... Don't like so Venom. much like that, but it'll be great once it gets cooler out. Just in the summer, it's. I don't like. I don't like how that feels. Yeah, but anyway, we're gonna cut this off here, and uh, do another video with our crafting items that we got. So we'll see you in a little bit. Thanks for watching Wing It Webcam with Mandu, and Devin, artistic three or seven. Cheers.